Everything in my gut is telling me to end this, but I feel too invested to walk away. That's what I'm sure most of us have been through something like this. It can be hard to walk away from someone because of our attachment style or past trauma. We can spend our time trying to figure out why this person is doing what they're doing to us. But eventually you realize that's a waste of time. You have plenty more power than you actually realize, but you've given your power to someone that is breadcrumbing you. When you actually find out why you're attached to this person, the easier it will be to walk away. So whether this is because of past trauma or your attachment style, once you find a trigger, then you can resolve it. This is why I always recommend writing your thoughts and feelings down. This will allow you to have a clearer mind and understand what's going wrong. And I know it's a lot harder to leave someone, especially if you've been with them for a long time. But the longer you stay with them, the more damage you're doing to yourself. If you sat down with your partner and they said that they will make a change, make sure you see them make a change. If your partner says they're going to make a change, make sure you see this change. Whether that's through therapy or other things that could help them develop. And if that doesn't work, then it's your time to walk away. Yes, it's easier said than done and it can be painful, but it'll be totally worth it. Love yourself enough to walk away from someone that doesn't care about you. For relationship and mental health coaching, click the link on my bio.